Restaurants around the Tri-State, they're closing after being evicted from their property. We're still working to figure out exactly which specific stores, but we are learning that this could impact more than 20 different locations. Ken Brown's live in Lebanon for us, where the Frishes along Columbus Avenue is now permanently closed. Ken? Yeah, and you can see in the sign behind me, they're directing people to the Frishes in Kings Mills. I want to step out of the way here because there had been box trucks in and out of this lot. In fact, it looks like the last one if I can zoom in here and show you, it might be pulling out right now. They've been loading freezers and other gear from the, uh, I think the kitchen up in these trucks. That's a third one I've seen pull out of the lot today, but this is the Frisch's in Lebanon. And for those that have frequented this location, you may notice that the big boy statue that sat in front of this restaurant is no longer here. That's been hauled away as well. And a lot of Lebanon residents have fond memories of this place. Frisch's lot in Lebanon is now empty. The store will be cleared out and years of history are disappearing because the company is nearly $4.6 million behind on the rent and eviction notices have been posted. Oh, I was sad. I was sad. And, you know, I do understand how things change and evolve over time. Um, and change can be good, but there's some things that I just wish would just stay the same. Amy Brewer has lived in Lebanon since the mid 80s and she tells us there are so many memories she has of Frisch's. It's that time of year when so many families have holiday memories of those Frisch's pumpkin pies, but Brewer tells us her holiday memories start with Halloween. You'd go buy some of those Halloween coupons and then you would go trick or treating and then as a treat for your kids, at the end of the night, they were all dressed up in costume. You'd go and you'd be able to afford to um, feed your family and just enjoy the moment. A 376-page court filing outlines Frisch's failure to pay rent to NNN REIT. While the court proceedings carry on, our media partners at the Cincinnati Enquirer got a statement from Frisch's that reads, quote, due to unforeseen circumstances and various other factors, Frisch's big boy restaurants will be closing certain locations. We look forward to serving our loyal and beloved Frisch's customers at other locations and apologize for any inconvenience, end quote. Two closures we've been able to confirm are in Middletown and Lebanon, but the Enquirer reports NNN REIT is trying to evict more than 20 sites in southwest Ohio. I went in and actually said thank you to each one of them that worked there and appreciated all that they did and that they would they will really be missed. So a week from yesterday, NN Reet and Frisch's are due back in court for another eviction hearing. Reporting in Lebanon, Ken Brown, Fox 19 now.